there's probably something about Dark Sonic that you didn't know. Well, I'm gonna tell you about it a little bit later, so stay tuned for that. But today, guys, I have a fresh new Roblox account started here today that we're gonna be using to make Dark Sonic a Roblox account. Now look at Dark Sonic. I mean, he looks absolutely epic. He's literally what he implies, all right? He's Sonic, but dark. And also, he has no pupils. So his eyes are completely white, and he just kind of looks a little creepy. But we're gonna be making him a Roblox account. And again, soon, I'm gonna tell you something about Dark Sonic you might not know, so stay tuned for that. But starting off here, we're gonna make the height all the way up, proportions all the way up, and width slightly down to around 90%, maybe 85%. That should look pretty good. And now we're going to look for the first item on the list. So I'm going to go ahead and go to shirts here. And we're going to go ahead and type in Dark Sonic and press the search bar. Let's see what pops up. Oh, this is good. Wait, wait, wait. We have the Dark Movie Sonic shirt. So we have the movie version similar to this one. And I'm liking that a lot. So let's go ahead and open up the pants because they linked them in the description, which is perfect. And I'm going to go ahead and buy both because they both look absolutely fantastic. And now we can get started on some of the other things. But first, let me go ahead and tell you what Dark Sonic is about. So guys, Dark Sonic is a dark super transformation achieved by Sonic the Hedgehog in the anime series Sonic X, which I also believe he might be in the movie as well. The multitude of fake chaos emeralds and Sonic's intense anger allowed him to achieve this transformation as we can see here, we see the transformation take place from Sonic to Dark Sonic. So I thought that was kind of cool if you guys didn't know the backstory behind Dark Sonic. But now that we have these shirt and pants, let's go ahead and go back to the avatar editor. I'm going to go ahead and slap it on. And I want to see something before we do the reveal here. And oh, okay, we need some white gloves. That is for sure. All right, so to put on white gloves, we're going to go to the left arm of the skin tones. We're going to make the left and right arm both white. And let's see how that looks like so far. Ooh, that is looking nice. That is looking super nice. I like that a lot. As well, I'm going to go ahead and put on an animation package for Sonic. I was going to do the ninja animation, but I think I'm just going to use something a little bit more basic for this like the arthro animation i don't think we need anything too fancy for this today now guys for dark sonic there's a few ways we can go about this for the rest of the character now we've when we've made sonic characters in the past besides the last sonic we made we've had to basically combine stuff like hair accessories and then ear accessories that aren't even hedgehog ears, they're more like fox ears. But in the recent Sonic times, Sonic has released an official game, meaning they have a fished, a fished? <laughs> what am I talking about? Meaning they have officially, not a fished, <laughs> <laughs> release some official Sonic merch in the catalog. So we actually have some Sonic items to go over. So I'm gonna go to the accessories here. I'm gonna go to all accessories and I'm gonna type in Sonic and let's see what we get. Okay, so we get a Sonic hat and a Sonic mask. Wait, is the Sonic mask new? I don't know if that's new, but we're gonna buy it anyways. It came out June 2nd, so it definitely is relatively new. And we have this one from April 14th, which is the Sonic hat. Now, it is not dark Sonic hat, but I think we're gonna use it because there's really not another option. We could go for like a spiky black hair that goes back like Sonic and some black ears, but it just won't look right. It'll be better if we use the official Sonic hat with the mouth. Now, that still leaves room for the eyes. And I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do with the eyes here very, very soon. So stay tuned for that. Oh my goodness. So you can only see the back of the character now, but this is looking amazing. Like if we were making an official Sonic account, we could make it absolutely perfect, but we're not making an official Sonic account. We are making dark Sonic, not the regular Sonic. So <laughs> I want to show you the front of this character, but I just can't. It's just too good to show yet. Now I told you guys about the eyes. So there's a few different ways I want to do this. There's one way where we can find basically a superhero eye mask that goes like this around the eyes and it has a completely white mask. Or I want to try something a little different, which I think will work out a bit easier, which is going to be maybe an overlay for the head that just makes it completely white. So I want to see if that exists because to be honest, I don't even know if it exists. So to see if it's going to exist, I'm going to go ahead and go to all accessories and go to white head and let's see. And yes, this is exactly what I want. I, I knew this could be possible and it's possible. It came out almost a year ago, faceless white head. So what this is going to do is it's basically going to erase the face that we have on. So, you know, you have to, by default, always have a face on the character. Well, if you have the faceless white head, it removes the face. So what this should do is make our character 
look like Dark Sonic. I think this will make it look like, I'm not entirely sure, but I will check it out. Okay, so we actually ran into a little bit of a problem here. It's that we have two face accessories. One is gonna be the faceless whitehead and the mask for the Sonic character. And then the third one is going to be the head, which is not really a problem, the Sonic head. But to combine them all, we have to go ahead and do the advanced strategy, which is where we go to each one, we go ahead and slap it in the section. And what that does is it allows you to have more than one of the same like face accessory or neck accessory or something like that. And uh, basically once I press save, this account will be completed. But I'm not gonna press save on camera. Actually, I will. I'm gonna press save, but I'm not gonna show you what it looks like yet. I'm gonna hop in game. We're gonna see how this character looks. And I just got a preview. It's behind my face cam. You can't see it, but let me tell you, this looks amazing. So if you guys are ready for this, make sure to drop a like, subscribe down below. Use star code Zeph plays with my aerobics or premium. And guys, we're about to reveal the dark Sonic character that we've been working on. And I hope you guys will enjoy because this is absolutely amazing. I can't wait to show you. What better way to reveal this character than in Sonic Simulator? Now, I actually haven't played this game, but I'm, I'm guessing it's some sort of simulator where you just kind of run around and uh, and gain points and get faster or something like that. I, I don't really know, but I see this little trail of stuff now. Do I get, oh, I get points for this. Do I get faster? Oh, I do get faster when I get this. Okay, so what better way to reveal Dark Sonic than in the official Sonic simulator game? Now, I haven't revealed the front of this and we're going to reveal it soon. Now, let's review a little bit of what we bought for this as a running <laughs> through the Sonic world. This is actually amazing. How have I not played this game before? I don't know. I'm definitely going to be playing this a lot. But anyways, guys, before we build a front, let's reveal this. So the shirt and the pants costed like five Robux each for Dark Sonic. Then we went ahead and slapped on the white gloves with the left and right skin tone, changing to white with the Arthro animation just for a little bit of high quality-ness. Then we slapped on the Sonic mask and head, which the Worst thing probably about this gown is probably the head, even though it looks amazing because it's an official Sonic head, but we did what we had to do. So we combined all that, then we put on a faceless white head and we had to do it with the advanced section. And let me tell you guys, it turned out amazing. I think the only complaint I have is that it's blue on the hair here and the ears. But other than that, I think it's an absolutely perfect account. And once I reveal the front of this, you're gonna see how well this looks like. So world two is up there. Should I go to world two or, now you know what, I'm going on here. I'm gonna keep going here and I'm gonna make it to world two eventually. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and reveal the front of the character. Drop a like, subscribe. And uh, you start cause Zeph plays when my rogues are premium. Let's reveal the front in three, two, one. And there we go. Doesn't this look awesome? I think this looks absolutely amazing because we literally have no eyes on the character and it just overall looks fantastic. So guys, let me know how I did down in the comments. Let me know who I should make next from the Sonic series. Should I make another Sonic? Let me know. I'd really appreciate it. Can we do this loop? And yeah, we can. No, we can't. We're too slow. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, have a nice day and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. Peace.